St. Paul Public Schools is to inspire and challenge every student to welcome and respect their families and to unite and strengthen the community in which we all live. I was actually involved back in 1991. I was at Harding High School as a music teacher, a choir director myself then, and it's just continued to bloom ever since. We have over 300 students, um, musicians, and visual artists that are here and uh, from band, choir, and orchestra across the district. We have all high schools in the district represented. We are part of the Ordway Honors, so we were selected from our school choir to come and perform here tonight. The St. Paul Honors Concert is an opportunity for um, honors musicians through St. Paul Public Schools to get together and um, perform in a large ensemble at the Ordway. Our band is like small, so it's like really cool to see like, just like he listen to everyone like playing together. It's exciting, but you can't show it. It's you, right on yeah, the stage. You're like panicking and you're like, don't mess up, don't mess up, don't mess up. And then you don't mess up and then you want to celebrate because you played perfectly. It was really fun like being with people from all of the different schools in the district and just like coming together and seeing with them. I knew there were going to be claps. I did not know like to the the extent to which everyone was going to be like almost hooping and hollering in the audience. It, it was great. Yeah. The, the biggest thing is you always think you're going to do bad. You're always super down on yourself. You're like, oh, I'm going to mess up. But nobody ever messes up. Everyone always plays it perfect. <laughs> Well, I just love that St. Paul Public Schools thinks this event is important. Again, 31 years now that they celebrate the students and all of the arts programs. This is an essential part of our core curriculums. When we do this, when we study the arts, we are studying everything else at the same time. I want to be a doctor, but I think that I will still bring the things that I have learned in groups like this. Like, I will bring friendships through the rest of my life. I'm looking to major in, like, musical performance. Um, so I definitely envision like singing in my future. I can't ever see myself without my violin and even though while my current dream job is to become a pharmacist I believe that having my violin and having the arts beside me will still be very essential to me. I think without it I wouldn't be me. <laughs> It's really about a lot of people coming together to make it happen. It's about the Ordway staff, it's about the St. Paul Public School staff, it's about the M, and it's really about the teachers and how the teachers are really preparing their students for an event like this, and the families that support music and the arts.